Teaching a man to fish in the Philippines isn't always a good idea. Um, this this relates to a friend of mine. Uh, he he's Filipino. He he's got quite a large um, farm in the Philippines. It's several acres. It's at least thirty six acres. I can't remember exactly, but he's also got fishing pools. And he employed this guy to basically look after his fish, because um, they you know just to fatten them up then eventually they harvest the pools and then sell the fish and then it's just a cycle of fattening fish basically um but you come to harvest and there was no fish the, you know there was hardly anything left in these pools and bear in mind this gamekeeper his job was just to look look after the pools so with him living on my friend's land and the fact that his bills were pretty non-existent because obviously electric and stuff he's tapped into what my friends got on the farm anyway um his wife lived with him and their kids etc but this guy's wisdom was to steal the fish um he would go out every night in a little boat with a light and draw the fish up and basically he was catching the fish and then selling them and here's here's a clincher in the philippines People will tell you what people have been doing. So it's not hard for somebody to go, oh yeah, your, your gamekeeper sold me fish last week. In fact, he sells me it every Friday. They have no problem with telling you because they, they've got no loyalty to the thief. Um, but the funny thing is, is the guy saw sort of like, oh, I'm out of a job now. What am I going to do? Where am I going to live? Um, you're an idiot. That's, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Because they do not connect the dots relating to the fact you steal everything. You're actually stealing from yourself. You've robbed yourself of a job. You've robbed yourself for your house. Um, you've robbed yourself for your um, income. And then you're standing there compo completely bemused at why this guy is so annoyed at you. And yet you think he's robbed you. Um, yet you've stolen entire crops of fish um, from multiple pools because it, it wasn't just one or two I mean if you see the thing is if you take one or two now and again you wouldn't even notice it because they, the fish breed anyway but this guy basically literally emptied the ponds and then it's just like oh, I've got no job oh, I've got no money because I'm stupid anyway so the money I did out of I lost it spent it gambled it because I haven't even managed to have a bit of common sense to put money away because this day would come. So no, it's not always a good thing to teach a man to fish. <laughs>